Wake that ass up early in the morning. The Breakfast Club. Yep, it's the world's most dangerous morning show, The Breakfast Club. Charlemagne the God, Angela Yee, Envy had to step, but we got two big steppers here right now. Mm. Yo. My man mm. Country Wayne yo. and Zay Tovin, yes, a.k.a. Yes, Drippin' Zay. Yo, yes, yo, yes, yo, 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 Charlemagne, yo, you said it. I've been waiting to get on here, drill, you know, oh, I came here and I want to sit in the chair with the artists who ain't, don't need nothing that, yo. I'm the first artist to come in here like this, y'all. No record or nothing, no record label, me and Zay, y'all. Hold on now, <laughs> so, so, so Drippin's a whole other person. Yo, yo, Drip, oh, yo. Yeah. You okay. haven't been seeing Drip yo, see, doing yo. his thing? He got merchandise? Yo, I got merch and everything. Like, I'm gonna get money. I just dropped the EP, everything. Yo, I'm hot out here in the city of Atlanta, yo. I'm Wayne, to I'm gonna go. be honest with you. I just thought Drip. you was... Drip, my bad. I yo. just thought I just thought you was getting so much money, you just was no. flexing on people. Because, you know, sometimes people get to a certain status, they change their identity and everything. No, that know. was you. That was you. You switched. <laughs> yo, we seen your money go and you shine brighter. Like, you got brighter and everything over here. Yeah, literally. You got younger. I seen the money. And I'm like, you one of my motivators. I like Charlemagne. Yo, you one of them that I watch. And be like, that money make you do something different. Yo. <laughs> what I love about Drip is that you went from being in the streets, right? Yo, yo, in the, yo, yo, <laughs> cut that part. Yo, yo, but yo, I was there. <laughs> yeah. I was really there. So, you know, yo, I was really there. And Zay was, Zay was there coming through. I didn't, I didn't put, I didn't got him out the trap. Yo, you got me out the trap and we dropping it and we taking over the rap mm -hmm. game because I'm the realest. And most rappers ain't handsome like Drill. How yeah. did you finance your career? Yo, 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 how I find it, yo, Angela. Cocaine! Yeah, hey, yo, <laughs> hey, I'm finna keep the whole interview. Yo, say on everything, don't, don't bring. Nah. Hey, I finance it through God. Yo, what was the yo. drug of choice you sold, Drip? Yo, got Charlemagne, you know, they bitch said you was the police. <laughs> but I thought you, I thought it was yeah. Rebel Club, not Vlad. Yo. Yeah. <laughs> Charlamagne, you supposed to, you from down there and you did it just because you went through your charge. Hey, let's talk about something else. But the EP, yo, Drip and Zay is out there. Now, yo. Zaytoven, that's a great cosign mm -hmm. um, for Drip to have Zaytoven actually do this EP. Yo. So, Zay, what did you see in Drip that made you say, okay, I'm a, I'm a blessing with these beats? No, no, I was, just, I was watching him. I kept watching him every day and I'm like, hold on. He might got some. Don't lie, you know Zay. I mean? It was no, the bag. Was no, it wasn't the bag. No. It wasn't the bag. Yo. It's opportunity, man. So, you know, I'm a guy that been in the game for a long time, so I'm looking for something new and innovative. In real. And yeah, real. In too. real. <laughs> Let's just be honest. Like, yo, he, he ready for a real one. You know, he had Gucci on, and I drooped in here, and it's like Atlanta is in me. And I'm bringing it to the city, and now we on the Breakfast Club. This is legendary for the streets for real, because rappers don't got too rich. Yo, mm -hmm. and they ain't, you don't feel the essence anymore. So, yo, Drip bringing the essence back to the rap game. Yeah. We need you to stay in your seat, Drip. Oh, okay, yo, I was just leaning up because, you know, it got hot because y'all asking questions I wasn't ready for. Now, Zay, it don't get much realer than Gucci now. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. you think Drip is on that level of realness? Well, you know, Drip yep. is a whole nother yo. other thing. This is a whole nother other thing. No, tell yeah. the truth. Hold on, Zay. Hold on. Yo, yo, no, yo. I'm the, yo it's I'm only the, one Gucci. Just, yo, it's only one Gucci, it's but it's only one Drip. It's only one Drip. Yo, okay. Yo, like, Drip do it different. Like, yo, see, I'm with the ladies and about the money. I'm not violent, yo. It, I'm a spiritual gangster. Okay, yo. okay. And he's honest. Break like, that I down. Like, Break I like that the fact that. Yo, a spiritual gangster, like, I don't gonna touch you because I'm gonna, you do something to me, I'm, I'm protected and I pray. Divinely protected, yo, there you go. And, and something gonna happen to you anyway. Let God yeah. ride for yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. God, God go. gonna spend the block for you. He has there you a clean. Go. There yo, you go. Yo, there you I go. just like the ladies and everything. Drip coming different. I just like the ladies and the money. The money, I just love it in the city, yo. How you get the name Drip? Because I was born with it. Yo, the Drip. Like, when I was born, my auntie done seen it in me. And, like, everybody buy Drip. Like, my, like they buy money. They buy things. I got it, too. This Flawless Diamonds in the Rolex. Yo, this 56000 But I, I was born with it. And everybody didn't have it. Everybody ain't born with it. They have to go buy it. And mm -hmm. I just got it. When I walk in the room, that presence you felt, yo, you knew it was real, yo. Yeah, I'm about to test and see if the jewelry real yo, right now. As yo, soon as this warm up. Test them, yo, warm up. Get his yo. teeth, too. Hit his teeth. Yo, <laughs> Angela Yee, yo. Because you looking young and rich, don't make no suggestions because he's not touching my mouth. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I've been waiting on that toast, though. Yo, yo, this the real one. Let me see, one. let me see, yo, let me see. Yeah, these the VVs. Okay. You want the flawless and the watch or the VVs? Don't you got to let that warm up oh, first? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yo. It's warmed up. Yo. Oh, oh okay, shit, no, yeah. drip. Yo, look at yo, drip. Yo, look yo, at drip. Yeah, that yeah. mean it's real, real, isn't it? Yo, you want the VVs? Let me try to watch, let me try to watch. Oh, yo, oh, don't flawless. It'll tell your machine. Oh, you got a machine real. for the flawless? Yo, don't flawless. God yeah, damn, yo, and you, and you want, yo. Let me do the air. Let me do the air. Yeah, everything. You, your people, 
Yo, you got an 1987 beep over here. <laughs> yo, you can <laughs> aim it, yo. I want to Yo. Uh-oh. Yeah, shit ain't no, going to click. That ain't going to click. Hold on, Put it on up. Put it on no, up. Drip. We don't need this in the scope, yo. <laughs> hold on. There you go, my guy. Oh, there you go. Okay, you okay, go. okay, okay, okay. Every, in the glasses. Let me put the diamond in the glasses. You won't see them? Yo, you oh, there you go, there you go, there you go. Oh, wow. That's drip for real. Let me go in your mouth. You know, Come hey, on, Charlamagne. Oh, my God. You not going in my mouth. That's oh, not, that's not envy. You not going in my mouth. <laughs> Yo, so that what it is, Drew. Charlamagne, no record okay. label, nothing. I already came in the game like this, y'all. Ain't no clean, y'all. My story is out, though. You know what it is. Now, you, since you talked about the women, let's discuss that yo, for a second. Yo, All right, because you have a song where you said you can't be your Russell Wilson, but you can be someone's future. Yeah, that's what I can't be your <laughs> Russell Wilson. But that's I toxic be, as fuck. Yeah, yeah, that's toxic, but that's what they like. See, when you toxic, it bring the toxins out their body. If you ain't toxins, them juices don't flow the same. Okay, if okay. If you toxic and she know you toxic, she gonna say she don't like you, but a different fluid come from her. So I'm just being real, out the real. Like, I can't be your Russell Wilson. Whisper, I could be your future. You won't <laughs> like the things I do, but the way I do it to you, y'all. That's actually a dope ass double entendre, though. Yeah, that's mm-hmm. real. You know what I'm saying? Yo, yeah. I'm, I'm not coming in the, the, the y'all, future. You gonna have a good time and all that for however, just, just count your times, enjoy it, because you don't know how long it's gonna last. But you gonna be able to say, I ain't gonna lie, I had a good time. I probably went on vacation. I probably mm-hmm. went to Miami, but okay, I'm okay. not gonna stay there all day. And we have children that take pictures in white robes. That, mm-hmm. ain't, that ain't me. That's wrong. Russell and di- no disrespect to Russell and Sierra, where they living, but you know, I could be your future because I'm out here in the streets. You wouldn't want that one day, though, to find you a good woman, a wife, and settle nah, down and nah, have a family? Nah. Bunch nah. of little drips running around? Nah, yo, I, yo, the driplets, yo, I, yo, yo, <laughs> they, they running around, but yo, I just can't be there all the time. I get bored. Like, I don't think you're supposed to wake up every day with the, like, the same woman. Like, God, I don't think he meant that for everybody because that's morning, bro. And morning mm. breath will take you out of here. So I know that's a sign you're not supposed to be sleeping together all the time. But yeah. aren't you taking in mad different morning breaths if you were a bunch of different no, women? Can't Who's you sleeping just brush with your me? Teeth? Who's sleeping with me? Yo, don't, yo. Oh, you I see what you're saying. Not, the energy of you being around me all day just unnecessary. Because like after the moment over, you really want to be like, bye. But I'm a realist to say that. Like yeah. go in the other room. Yo, and I see you another time, yo. Okay, okay. But, you, but that turn you on because you mad. When I leave, you like, I can't stand home. You know, but if it just all that every day, you're going to get bored. True, you true. You got to put online like it's real, but it ain't. Yo. Let me ask you this. Since you've <laughs> had this drip for so long yo. and you a ladies' man, yo. has a woman ever got you for something? Like you put the watch down in the hotel room yo. or? Yo, yo, once one got me for 15 rights. Woo! Yo, bro. Cash? Yo, 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 15 right. She got me, yo. And she got me good. And she she ain't doing good right now. What you mean? Yo, <laughs> she she looking bad. I seen her on social media. I was like, oh. Because God's <laughs> putting the block for yo, you. Yo, yo, so, yo. He, he got her out the way through the paper. But I don't know what she did. She must have used it literally. Yo, like he's bought something else for somebody else. Yeah. Yo, but she, yo, she got me for 15 rights, Angela Yee, but you know, y'all, that ain't nothing. I spend that on you, y'all. I bet, y'all, this, <laughs> I really want to come here because you looking good, y'all. Now, yeah. listen, I'm not going to yeah. lie. I heard your you song, one of that. your songs. <laughs> you try to ignore that. <laughs> you going to let her curve <laughs> you like she, that? She, she going to let her curve you like that? We going to get dude. right back to it. You think I ain't on yet, yo. <laughs> Speak to me, yo. Because I do see you pay for trips and everything, right? And yo, you... oh, yo, the paper is, yo. I keep what the, you got? I oh, keep the paper. Oh, that ain't nothing. Big drip. This your pocket. I'm finna spend this in New York. What the store? Yo, I was just gonna spend all of this, yo. I'm disappointed you got 20s, though. Oh, yo, that ain't. Oh, that's for Give the cow. Give all those to ye. That's Give them the, to ye. That's for the <laughs> cow driver. Get all the ye. Yo, ye, yo, ye, we gonna know. She gonna get the cards. Yo, she gonna get the cards. I'm gonna let her spend it all. You can have the account number. Just oh, not really? my phone. You drop, you drop a hundred. Yo, it ain't nothing, y'all. I leave that in hope. Oh, leave it then. Leave, leave it. Don't worry about it. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it for the broke robbers. So when they come through here, we can, can I put it in your cup? There you go. Leave it for the broke radio for the personality broke too. When the broke robbers come through and faking like they got it, y'all. Drip left song for you. Just manifest that. Manifest that honor in that cup. And there's no drip came through here for y'all. Cause y'all, y'all, I ain't flexing y'all. Zay, what was the recording process like with drip? Oh, uh, just what y'all saying right now. 
down. Like we, easy. I just had, I had a ball just in there watching them do his thing. It's you know easy. what I mean? It Coming up with the music. Do you write? You don't even write, do you? No, no I, don't I ain't got to write. I ain't do no writing. Know, me and Jay Z, <laughs> and who else do that? It was me and Jay Z. Biggie, Biggie, like we yeah. in New York. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Not saying I'm on <laughs> they level, cause I know I'm in New York. I ain't got time for no cap. Run on my foot, but mm-hmm. yo, know, it's just. <laughs> I don't got the right. It comes like I could spit right now from the spirit. Let me hear something. Let me hear something from the spirit. Drip. I'm coming from the bottom, headed to the top. Yeah, you know I drill, but you know I never drop. Mm. I'm on Breakfast Club with Angela Yee and Charlemagne. Mm. I got Zay Tobin, his curls, they doing their thing, yo. <laughs> yeah. Who is that? A replacement for it. Yo, I'm in, New York, I'm in New York City, yo. I'm coming harder than everybody. Thinking the plan. I'm having an experience that's out of body. Yo, it's drill. That's yeah. nothing to Hey, Zay Tobin, your curls are Doing their thing I though, bro. I ain't gonna lie. That, that's some. Yo, that's, you look rich, man. Yo, you look embarrassed. I wonder why his curls do that. Like, you, why your curls just different? He said he got how you gonna do that? Yo, <laughs> how you yo, gonna do that to your producer? No, I'm just him, saying, man. yo, produ- who produced the curls? I've been wanting to ask you that. <laughs> I hated to get on Breakfast Club and ask this question, but his curls is different. You want that? Uh, no, I'm just. I keep it nappy, yo. Yo, yo, I got family in Nigeria and everything. Yo, mm. <laughs> Zay, you got a movie coming out Thanksgiving, right? Yes, sir. What's Finesse. that about? Two finesse. Uh, it's you know we in Atlanta, Georgia, man. So you know it's a it's the it's the finesse game. Mm-hmm. Yes. So you know it's a comedy, and it's uh it's it's all about you know the smoke and mirrors. Do you but feel like the pandemic has elevated that finesse? Oh come on! It's like I done made more Yo, money in a pandemic than than anything. <laughs> And it's like, you know, you got to be creative. You know what I mean? Atlanta taught, taught me how to be creative, and that's what we, you know, we shine a light on that. Word. So what do you mean by it? during the pandemic you made more? Explain that. It's just I got to find new ways of making money. You mm-hmm. know, it's not, I can't go out and do DJ shows. I can't travel this place and this and that. Mm-hmm. So to connect with artists, to, con- you know, to connect with different people, I got to do different things. And it's almost via, you know, the internet, but... People want to be tapped in, so you know it opened the doors for me to be more creative. And that's, but you, and that's crazy because you're already a natural creative. Yeah, you can mm-hmm. tell that by just making music. So mm-hmm. that's probably just tapped into something else Indeed. in your brain. Like that's man. why, like I'm right here with him. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? It's yeah, some it, different. Country Wayne, country Wayne now, though, drip, okay, though. Country Wayne's oh, yeah. here. Hey, now. hey, oh, tell you what, a Jesus Papa chain. <laughs> salute to Tay. <laughs> salute to Southern <laughs> Bread in here. <laughs> so I don't know. How do we know when Country Wayne making oh, a parent? He took his teeth out. Yeah, he took you took the teeth out, and um, the the demeanor has left. You gonna tuck your chain? I'd like to um meet Buddy. No, I got my chain. You want me? Oh yeah, Buddy. Buddy got that money, baby. I got. Buddy got that money. See, Buddy, Buddy, Buddy is retired and got a full one. Okay, Angela. <laughs> and if you know any friends in the world that need something, Buddy got you. <laughs> buddy gonna pay for it, and he don't care. Hey, you, hey, you know what's crazy, Wayne? I heard somebody, somebody was talking about you the other day, and it was like, um, they can't even get Wayne to do no TV or nothing like that because you making so much money doing stand up and everything else. Oh yeah, it's, yeah, I, I can't do no TV right now. I just did a TV show with BT though. Uh, you did? It's coming out, okay. and, I, and I got a book deal, man. They gave me a book deal, almost seven figures for my life story. For real? Straight up. Mm-hmm. Who, who you did it with? Uh, I don't know if I'm supposed to be talking about them people. They up here though. They in New York. <laughs> Tommy and Schuster, <laughs> Random House. It might, but I don't want to say the wrong one, but you know okay, about the book okay. situation. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They gave me a book deal, man, and what it is, I'm doing so much of my own stuff, and they still, when they see, you know, auditions and stuff, it'd be like, it just don't, like, I'm about to shoot my own movie in January in okay. Atlanta, you know what I mean? Um, And it's just like, when you do your own thing, because y'all don't trust the system. I was out there in L.A. for two years. Mm-hmm. And it's like, you go, you having these general meetings and all that. I'm like, man, hold up, man. So you telling me I'm really waiting on y'all to give me a year. So at, at, at some point, it just became, bro, let me do my own thing. And mm-hmm. and I and that's when I really turned up. Mm-hmm. I felt like who I was when I got in this thing. When I, It's like I, I was an entrepreneur getting into the coming the game, and then the coming the game turned it back to a job. Because mm-hmm. you just doing shows, doing shows and coming to the club. But, man, hey, man. And uh, you wait on Hollywood to give you opportunities, but man, most of the time that opportunity ain't coming. And that shit'll suck your creativity. Oh, it take mm-hmm. it because now you ain't even around your people anymore. So now you get on, you get in LA out there, you you on an island. You're mm-hmm. not even connected to normal, the soil, the soil yeah. of of creativity, man. When the pandemic hit. Man, I was man, I was really man, I was really broke. I went broke because really? during the pandemic, yeah, man, I, that's my book. Man, I was down thirteen thousand dollars. Mm. Huh? But then I rented up to sell me in in in, in, in um uh three hundred days. Wayne, mm-hmm. ain't no way in hell. Now hold show... on, I can, okay. Now let's let's Listen. be clear though. You do got a lot of kids, Yo, and that is the number one was, reason. I'm a, I'm, I'm a realistic person. <laughs> when that pandemic hit, you know you got by the hump. You know what I'm saying? Just paid taxes now. You know what I'm saying? Trying to pay them early, do right. I shouldn't did that. Hundred thousand, right? What? 
You said honey. taxes. No, on my I just paid taxes. The mm -hmm. pandemic hit in March. Okay, okay. I'm trying okay. to pay them early. Got you, got you, got trying you. Trying to do right. Yeah, yeah I shouldn't yeah. did that. I should just kept it. But anyway, I had about I had about a hundred grand, but my bill is about seven eight a month. So that that first bill came. We ain't know nothing about no SBA or nothing. So yeah, I'm yeah. like, God, dog, boy, I got down to 13,000 credit cards matched out and everything. Damn. I was, but, mm. you know, I my faith in God. So I was like, well, all this Jesus Papa stuff I've been talking about. I'm finna, <laughs> <laughs> now I'm, I'm, I'm going to see if this book of Job for real now. I'm finna see it, man. I'm about, <laughs> man, I'm about to sell Nutriburst. One time, I was like, shit. Oh, gosh. Hey, for real, I'm, about, I'm a hustler. You was about to do Nutriburst. I'm about to do, about to do Nutriburst. I ain't got no pride. You know what I mean? Mm. I, I, I was like, look, bro. But uh, I say, man, this the time that all this positivity and help is on the way and Jesus Papa is real. And, man, God came to me. And I, was, I had all my kids to the house. It uh, he would just like start doing these skits, and I wasn't doing it for the money. I'm like, well, it'll keep my bulls. Yeah, give the people, man, and then it just that thing went up. Like that's great when you do something and it's not for the money, and yeah. then it bring you money. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I Definitely. knew God was gonna do something. Cause I was like, man, I don't scream his name too loud. And boy, mm -hmm. he took me in the pandemic. He he gave me my independence back to the point I didn't even need Hollywood. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? Man, what the fuck am I missing? Because I thought you was out here doing all types of shows man, and shit no before the pandemic. Up, man, no show don't add up. Man, you go to Cumber Club, you pick up 30, 50,000 when you hot. But man, that ain't no... Think about... the Okay, the agent gonna get 10. Manager yeah. get 10. So if I make 40 grand, 8 grand gone. You yeah. got 32 left. It gonna cost you 7 grand to travel for real. Especially yeah. if you got a crew. So you had 25 <laughs> ranks. Then child support. Now, then child support, man. That You ain't finna get rich just touring. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean, and that's what I had to learn, man. And you got to, you don't know it until it stops. Yeah, right. you know what I'm saying. You got to own your content, and you know they, you know they teach us about that, but you don't never know it. But online, I learned the game. It ain't about the money I'm making. Now I'm making a lot of money online, but it's the fact that even if I start right now, mm -hmm. I'm gonna make a certain amount because the content. And it's like, man, that's what put me in that. You got catalog. Yeah, catalog is like, man, these people, boy, they'll tour you to death and keep you out there on that road and won't even grow your career because they. You just torn, 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 but right. I could count. I'm yeah. like, man, yo, I'm making a million dollars a year, but after taxes, and you know, if you pay your taxes mm -hmm. for real, you know how that go, man. Like, <laughs> no, I don't. Hmm. Oh, yeah. I pay my yeah. shit. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, so you pay them, you know yeah. where I'm coming from, and man. And you have a lot of expenses. Yeah, man, mm -hmm. child support, man. I got nine kids for real, man. My baby mama don't work. I pay everybody rent. So this, uh, but that's you look stressed just thinking <laughs> yeah, about it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. I've been doing it so long. <laughs> man, just, but the pandemic turned me to a situation where I said, I never got worried about that again. You know what I'm saying? No, that's right. I, I went out there, I went out there and got it. I ain't playing now. Like, I got, I went and got the merch. I got the book. I got I got a TV show of shooting a movie. I make money online every day. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm, I'm in, and, on, and I'm on the road. And my, the on material, I mean, on content made my show price go up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It took me up. You know what I'm saying? So. You don't get to get, carry the kids on the taxes? Oh, yeah, but after, man. Yeah, you get to carry them, but man, taxes, man. I think only after a certain amount too. It doesn't matter, right? Yeah, like, you give each child a thousand. They let you get each child a thousand dollars a month. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You get each child a thousand dollars a month, and then whatever you, I pay a payroll check every month. They tax that. You know what I'm saying? And then whatever left at the end of the year, they're gonna tax that. Well, at least the kids is working now too. Oh yeah, they make bread. <laughs> my children make. It, hey, my children came back. My son read this car, man. It called by, it called by fifteen, fourteen thousand fifty. But his video made fifty thousand. That's right. So it's like this a family business now. This online stuff, it's just like it changed the game. Well, my agency and everybody mm -hmm. had to get on board. I, I respect the honesty because you know it's a lot of smoke and mirrors on social media too. Oh, yeah, yeah. A lot of people with a bunch of followers, bunch of likes, a bunch of views, but they don't got the money to that match. Money ain't, so I respect uh, you being honest. Oh yeah, like, no nobody gonna keep it. If you don't be real, you gonna get real results because mm -hmm. if you ain't real. See, I tell everybody, my mama them ain't get blessed like me because they weren't real. We used to be poor, <laughs> and she will not even pray for no food. I'm talking about she pray for a man and everything. Listen, lady, my spirit is wicked right now. Please pray for some food. You praying for a relationship. <laughs> pray for... So I tell everybody, even at my show, when you be real, you get real results because God can't hear you. If I'm out here acting like I got it, God say, I can't bless you because you're going to act like you had it anyway. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. So he like these stories, ones who... Man, and and I had thirteen thousand last year around the time. In one year, man, I bought me a million dollars. I bought I don't bought everybody a car, my son, you know what I'm saying? Like spent a million or eight hundred decorating the house. Mm -hmm. I'm moving up to November, but these because I'm so transparent and real online. Mm -hmm. God like I could use Wayne, cause Wayne gonna keep it gangster. 
If I ain't got it, I'm not finna be one of the ones like everything good. No, the hell it ain't. That's right. That's right. Yeah. Did your mom ever? Did she ever get a man? Did nah, that nah. My mom, nah. She, 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 she loved my daddy, but my daddy, um, uh, she put her faith in my daddy, man. My daddy, he, he ain't come through like you know. What yeah, I'm saying? yeah, yeah. You know how it is when a woman put their faith in a man and he lose, you lose your faith Damn. because most time women do that. You gotta put your face in. My baby mama's one. They gave their energy to me, even though I ain't with them. Yeah, they got a career. They, you know, but my daddy, you know, my daddy and my mama were, they came from the streets, but they mistakes allowed me not to do a lot of things. Mm-hmm. Drugs really told them down, you know what I'm saying? So they were smart and everything, but uh, I seen, so it made me never do drugs. It made me stay away from certain things. You ain't you know? on no drugs? No, nah, I ain't never did nothing. Never yeah. smoked, drank, no. Nah. Damn, it's just get, turned up. That's just you, the spirit. No, nah, nah, I get that. I, you know, I had them kids early. So once I had them kids early, I couldn't really afford to mess up. That's real. I had That's seven real. kids by the time I was 22. God damn. So by the time you don't mess up like, <laughs> man, I had two children. They four days apart. I went to the hospital, man, uh, for one child. Four days later, I came back. The, she was, the nurse was like, did you leave anything? <laughs> <laughs> like yeah, another child. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so, did yeah. you ever try condoms? Ever? Yeah, yeah, I tried them, but I, I tried them. Uh, but now he do Plan B. Yeah, Plan B don't work either, boy. What? <laughs> N- not for mine. I get mine different. My mm-hmm. man, Plan B, they owe me some money. Why well, you don't like condoms though, man? Like, no, I like condoms. Ain't no I way. Like, I like the condoms after that moment, but like, what? I'm gonna tell you. <laughs> See, I was in high school. Okay. And we was okay. all raw dog, like Boo said. They were young, so I rung and fresh, so I robbed all of them. And the Boosie said that. But it just, it just, uh, hey. Did you call Boosie to try to justify? <laughs> you quoted Boosie, yeah. like you quoted the scripture out the Bible yeah. just now. I quoted Boosie. <laughs> it, it was just, Boosie said it that. It just felt different. <laughs> you know, I started off with a call over there. I was like, oh, yeah, this is the greatest. Then one day I did it without, I'm like, wait a minute, you know, and, and I get it. But I was first, man, three of my baby mamas, I dealt with them one time. The first time I dealt with them, they got pregnant. Oh, good Damn. job. Good job. <laughs> Angela, you hmm. listen here. Well, I mean, it's a, well, I'm sure your kids are a blessing. So oh, yeah, they're a blessing yeah, now, man. Go. I ain't going to lie. My kids will keep me. We moving in the house together uh, um, by ourselves. Uh, me and my kids, that's what keep me going now, though. Mm-hmm. But uh, <laughs> at this point, it's be fruitful. So you don't time. even pull out. Let me tell you what happened. <laughs> I, once one of them I did. Oh, I, I pulled out, but I don't know where. At least, I don't know. I guess people get pregnant from their uterus or something because I don't know how did she You got. probably have like the premature, like a yeah. little bit come out first. Yeah, yeah, I don't know what happened. But mm. all along came back 99.9. I had a test on them. And then <laughs> when it came back 9, the first one came back 99.9. I'm like, well, shoot, they ain't a hunter. You know what I mean? <laughs> I was like, this the, uh, <laughs> hey, I'm like, hell, this the ain't a hundred. one percent chance. I'm reading the paper, it says, yeah, this is this not a hundred percent. I'm like, hey, this might not be mine, but <laughs> all them children of mine, man, they all good. <laughs> and hell, we just, it's just a big, a uh, big village. So Have how you- do you and Zay connect, Wayne? Man, me and Zay connect, man, you know, my artist drip. I hear Zay up on, cause I, I hear Zay up like, hey, I mean, I got drip. And I always wanted to rock with Zaytoven. If I ever did, I say, man, drip, I so hot. I don't know what to do with him because he's not, I can't, he, you know, it's like an NFT because what happened, they came with the NFT ideas. Mm-hmm. I said, mm-hmm. damn, if drip got something tangible like music, hook up with Zay, I said, mm-hmm. we're going to put him out there and he's going to start out with a fan base. Mm-hmm. So I was like, man, I put drip out here. Cause I used to want, I used to rap anyway, but nobody mm-hmm. knew. So I was like, man, drip going to take off. I already knew what to do with him. I was like, man, drip. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put him out here, you know what I'm saying? And he gonna get the streets. He got country, he got country Wayne fans already, and mm-hmm. and it was just too easy not to do. How, how, why did you take him serious, eh? As a no, guy, no, I, I I actually became a fan. I used to see him on on Facebook every now and then, mm-hmm. like, oh, he funny. But what really got me was the fact that he was clean. Like I'm a guy, you know, my dad a pastor, my mom a choir director, so mm-hmm. I come up, you know, I'm a mu- I'm a church musician, you know what I mean? Till this day, still so. Even just clean music or clean comic, I was a Sinbad fan. I was, you know, so when I saw him and I kept seeing him, oh, he don't even curse in none of his uh, videos or nothing like that. That would automatically drew me to him because now I can show my kids, I can show my parents, you know, mm. without nobody getting offended. Mm. So when I met him and then I see even with his what, what he's about, like with the Jesus popping, you know, it's all it's all that's godly all. stuff. So it it connected with me in the same way. So that's like okay, I love to hook up with him. So when he tapped in with me, I'm like, oh, this is perfect. So, you know, I feel like it's something God put together 
And here we are right now. Yeah, so. and it's heating up in the streets too, yeah, man. Drip man. out though. For people don't know, but drip really. Even when I go to my shows, bro, I, I can't. It's messing up my jokes. <laughs> they want to see you perform. They, they see want drip too. They want drip. That's good though, because you started off like you said as a rapper, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. And people didn't know that, and now here it is, full circle. Yeah, and got an EP out. Yeah, yeah. God yeah. say whatever you put in, he won't waste nothing. He brought it back, boy. It is easy bite. too. They rock it. They but rock. it do be making me laugh sometimes, like listening to the um, EP. <laughs> I'd be like, am I supposed to be laughing? Because laugh, some oh, of yeah. it is still funny. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. I'm like, is it funny because it's country Wayne? Because it sounds good, but then it's still funny. Yeah. So I'm like, how? What's the balance there? Man, just I just say, look, I'm a rap, high rap, but add a little like drip mm-hmm. with drip spirit and drip got a mentality like he really a good person, but he just he like the streets and he don't know nothing else. And he don't trust nothing else. So it's like, man, he believe in what he believe in. Like that song, I can't be your Russell Wilson, but I could be your future. He ain't trying to not. He just tell at least he being honest. He got a song called Real One. She fell in love with the drip. <laughs> and hey, drip just letting you know, like, hey man. I don't this, need no favor. Oh yeah, and no favor. <laughs> drip got one called No Favor. That's my yeah, that's one of yeah. my favorites. Uh, like, yeah. I don't need no favor. Cause the favor could come from a hater. They'll come do your favor. And then talk about you later. You know what I'm saying? That's just real. So you don't think mm-hmm. they told me doing drip a favor? Huh? Drip. They so told me one of the fifty greatest producers of the twenty first century. Yeah, this is this is a blessing together. This okay, is, this is peanut it's a butter. Collab. It's a collab. This, this collab, cause Drip got the internet. Man, Drip don't took the internet over. Yeah, yeah. Like okay, Drip okay. is harder than sure. rappers on the internet because Drip is it's like a movement. Rappers use other outlets to keep them relevant. Mm-hmm. Drip is keeping itself relevant, and he really got the he got the the rappers got the industry, but Drip really got the people don't fell in love. Like they root for you know how a neighborhood. A New York might be rooting for a New York rapper. Mm-hmm. They know about it first. Mm-hmm. Danny Blow, you got people in each city, New, uh, you got people in New York, each state, everywhere rooting for Drip in one neighborhood. Okay, so okay. he's like his home base is the United States. So that just mm-hmm. that man Drip. Shoot, even time CAA, you know CAA. Yeah, yeah. They was this merch company right here at first. This <laughs> shout out Drip Entertainment. When I first brought up Drip, like no, we can't put gold teeth on our site. They they don't sit merch. Uh, let's do the drip merch. The drip merch dropping soon. You know what I'm saying? Like the drip merch dropping this week or next week. Like he just man drip really grabbed the internet in a whole nother level. And when I created him September 30th, that's why that's his birthday. I told my dog Southern Bread. I said man, <laughs> Southern this, Bread. I said yeah. drip is about to take the culture because Country Wayne always had. They knew me. The hood knew me because you know I've been doing it, but I never fed it because I did clean comedy. I'm dancing online, but Drip went and grabbed the other audience, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. the Boots audience and all that world, and, 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 and he just got the streets right now because he is a regular person that you can really see in the hood every day right, versus right. he ain't that rich. Like, he, I can't see Drip buying Gucci and stuff all the time. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. He comfortable in a digging suit or jersey, mm-hmm. and he just, you know, he your cousin. So it's like a different vibe. Yo. Can I ask you a life question? Oh, yeah, ask me anything, Angela. Yo. Okay, so when it comes to your children's mothers, right, because mm-hmm. you take care of things, what is it okay for them to date Yeah, they can date. Guys? Let me take this off, because you finna ask a hot question. <laughs> <laughs> Man, listen, my baby mama go get anybody they want. I'm still going to pay their bills. They can stay there. That don't happen before. Okay. Yeah, they, they could talk to anybody, man, because I, I, I can't be a Russell Wilson. Because I be, um, sometimes when I watch your sketches, I was like, because I love watching you online, because it uh-huh. is like watching TV already. Mm-hmm. But I be looking like there's a little bit of truth in some of this, oh, right? Because yeah. there's a lot of like the little jealous things. Yeah, baby <laughs> mama, get jealous. they don't get jealous of I'm each other. I'm talking about you getting jealous. Oh, me? <laughs> no. No, no, no. See, Do you I, ever get a little jealous? Do I ever get a little jealous? Me, uh, it's hard for me to get jealous. To the point, you know, probably back in the day when I was young, but mm-hmm. we don't been through. I don't see my baby mamas with other guys uh, after I don't left them. You know what I'm saying? So at this point, I want them to live their best life because I'm darn sure going to live mine. Like, if they find a man or whatever, I pay their bills and everything, but they find some. But it's hard to find another way, though. You know what I'm saying? I know. It has to be intimidating for anybody they date, too, to be like, well, this is my child's father. You yeah. know. You ain't going to find a way. And then you be doing songs where you be like, uh, that's my ex, but she still let me hit. Yo, yo, you ain't gonna find no way. Every, every ex I had, every, every ex I had, I'd never find another way. I treated them too good. For real? Yo. But yeah. then you, but is cheating a woman good? Because, like, you had kids, well, you said that maybe it was only one time, four days apart. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, no, I'm talking about no, no not them women. I wasn't with though. Okay. I'm talking about the relationships I don't been. In. I don't been in like three. I don't been in three real relationships, three and a half. Since mm-hmm. since we known you, no, or since, like in life. No, since y'all know me, I only been in one. Who? Yeah. Is that? Jess, hilarious. Yeah, Jess. Oh, big yeah. Jess. All yeah, right, Jess. what up, Jess? Yeah, Jess. Shout and out to at Jess. least y'all cool with each other now. We love to see that. Yeah, yeah. Me Unless Jess. you're not again. No, nah, me and Jess cool, okay. man. I'm always cool with it. How like. you fuck that up, man? Jess a good one, man. Man, listen, I'm a good one. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm the catch. <laughs> yeah, I'm catching wins. Yeah, 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 I'm the one. Yeah, you crazy. Hey, I'm catching wins, man. Yeah, I'm, a, yeah, I'm a country boy. Hey, I'm a country boy in New York City, right? Who got the name country and is in New York City, right? Hey, man. Me and Jess is on, you know, hey. Hey, hey, man. Hey, just, hey, we cool, though. Yeah, she yeah, young. yeah. She, <laughs> it's going to be hard to find another Wayne, boy. The Wayne, boy, Wayne know, the, Wayne know what to do. I'm blessed. So Ooh. now what's next after this EP? Are uh, you planning to do... Oh, man, Drew, man, Drew, it will be probably be performing at the Hip Hop BT or something that year. I'm going to take him. He's just hot. Like, I just know, you know what I'm saying? He got the people, and I know what to say. He got a voice where he ain't got to make no hit. He could really speak to the people who listening, and they gonna make enough noise. Remember the forty eight laws of power when the, the dude uh, laying the brick and winning the circus or whatever, mm-hmm, and mm-hmm. got people to come. Drip gonna make enough noise with his people. PT Barnum. It, 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 it make you pay attention. So so drip man, drip taking over like cause he got the he got he came he was blessed man. Country Wayne blessed him like God bless Country Wayne. Country Wayne blessed drip and. God write Country Wayne's story, so he wouldn't let me fail, even when I was down to $13,000. I ain't going to let Drill fail. Drill mm-hmm. going, I'm going to keep him pumping. Because he owe me some money. I don't put some money in. Congra- congrats to you, too, Zay Tobin, for being named one of the 50 greatest producers of the 21st oh, yeah, century. Man. That's, that's big. 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 That's, that's appreciate big. Appreciate it. Appreciate Shout it. Out. Shout out, I man. I was scared, man. I ain't going to lie. When I seen that list come, I said, man, watch, I'm not on here. Really? <laughs> yeah. You thought they was going to front on you? I Why, because mean, the South bias, maybe? I don't know. It's just mm-hmm. one of those things. You know, I've, I've been doing this for a long time, and a lot of times I feel like I get looked over. Mm-hmm. But, you know, it's all good. But when I remember my lawyer sent it to me, because I wasn't paying no attention, mm-hmm. he sent it to me. So I said, boy, I know he sent this to me, and he, we going to get on the phone like, bro, we mad. Why they didn't put us on there? But I looked on there. I'm on there. I said, that's it. That's a blessing. Wow. So oh, that was so, big for me. I ain't even know that. Zay. Yeah, that's big, man. That's big for me. Well, you finna try to go up on the price. Yeah. That's right. Last year's price. Your name will be your manager. The, pr- the price been up. <laughs> put some emphasis on that. Yeah, the fifth grade is it. I ain't know it was a list. When the list came out. <laughs> so you think you're getting your proper respect now? Uh... I, I believe so. Mm-hmm. You know, I believe I get what I deserve. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. To some people, I'm the, you know, I'm the dopest producer in the world. To other people, it's like, oh, he cool. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? But I take it how it comes. It's, you know, it's all good. And what I, are some things that you haven't done yet that you like, okay, I still got <clears throat> to get this? Oh, uh, I didn't work with everybody possible, really. And to me, things like what I'm doing now, like what I'm doing with Country Wayne, it's like it's innovative, it's new, it's something that somebody else ain't doing. Mm-hmm. So, and I think that's what has kept me around for so long. Yeah, I think my first big song was So Icy in 2004. Dang. So to even be lasting this long in the game and yeah. still relevant, I feel like, you know, I, I feel like each year I go up a notch. I'm not declining. I'm, you know, I'm going up. So how, how did, I know this old, but how did the, how did that Gucci Jeezy versus feel to you? Were you there? I was there. I was, okay. man, I was dancing on the stage the whole time. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I was right there with Gucci. And it, you know what I mean? Uh, it was just amazing to, to be there because So Icy was the song that, you know, that made everything pop off. And I remember at the time, but we was fighting. It was like a real fight over the song. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So I'm tied, but I'm tied to Gucci. Me and Gucci work with each other every day. This is my bro. So to for the song to blow up and then it almost get blackballed, to come back years later and, you know, it be one of the biggest verses that you see and to be right there, you know, is unexplainable. You know what I mean? I will say it got a little, you know, a little tense in the room. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> But, you know, it, it's definitely dope to be there. So at, at the time when, I, I think the story was Jeezy wanted So Icy for the album. Mm-hmm. So I'm sure you had to sign off on some of that too. You probably wasn't. I, so I couldn't they put sign pressure? off. Man, okay. I was couldn't hear in the barbershop at the time. Wow. And I'm getting people come to pick up, pick me up like, hey man, come roll with me, bro. Because, you know, we got to get the paperwork signed. I'm like, well, hold on. I can't sign the paperwork with you. Me and Gucci, this Gucci song, we did this, you know, together mm-hmm. at the crib. So it was just one of them things where I was just stuck. Like, it was a blessing. I got my first big song, but at the same time, I'm kind of nervous because it's like, well, dang, I do want to be on Jeezy album. I know this is going to be the biggest thing going, but at the same time, 
this is me and you know this is what me and Gucci do like you know this is something me and Gucci put together. Man, that says a lot about your character. Cause at the time you said you was working in the barbershop, Yeezy had a bad boy deal going. He had the Def Jam thing shit going at the time. Yeah, yeah, he was red hot in the street. Like that says a lot about you, bro. But me and Gucci though, you gotta think me and Gucci like brothers at this time. Mm -hmm. He at my house every day. We recording with each other every day. So ain't no way in the world I'm finna you know do something with these people over here, and and cut my cut my bro out. Ain't no way in the world. So. It had to feel good at the end of the verses because when, when they did So Icy together, that's when you knew, like, oh, okay, it's, it's all good. It's, they solid. They now solid. they on tour together, yeah. you know what I mean? Now it's big. That was it's definitely big. That was real, man. That was, that was big moving for the South. That's and real. Jada, and Jada Kids just came, took New York back on the. But that verse is dope. That was yeah, that yeah. was a good one. That made you just want to rap for no reason. <laughs> Speaking of respect, y'all feel like y'all get y'all respect because see, like people try to like do what y'all do now, like was, like Charlemagne, Envy, and uh, Angela Yee. Nah, we living our life. I'm good. <laughs> My life is amazing. I'm gonna interview y'all, man. I'm trying to, I'm trying to, <laughs> I'm trying to practice. I got a podcast coming. I don't copy y'all too. Oh, you got a <laughs> podcast coming? Yeah, yeah. You got Who is coming out with? Oh, uh, really? It's supposed to be on. Um, we ain't announced it yet, but I hit, I hit um. You announcing all kind of stuff here that you're yeah. not supposed to announce. Yeah, I don't, I don't care. They Come can't on. find me. <laughs> Come on. Me, me and B. Simone are supposed to be doing something. I okay. hit B up because I feel like she, you know, she got her opinion. And I feel like it'll be um something that, because a lot of women di agree to disagree with me. Mm -hmm. So I just wanted somebody, who, you know, who who's transparent. She's real transparent online. Me, her, and her friend Megan will be doing a podcast. Okay. Mm -hmm. So they putting together now and all that. I want to hear it, man. Fuck with your boy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. for sure. For but sure. You know what I Podcast to Network, Black Since you brought up B. Simone, mm -hmm. I saw people was mad about her um, charging money. Did you see this? $10 oh, to, my, yeah. to be part of her friends, like on Instagram. Yeah, I seen that. That only friends could see or whatever. I'm like, why are people mad? Either you pay or you don't. Yeah, mm -hmm. I think, uh, 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 I ain't even mad about the only fans for women. Because I'm like, man. Whatever, Men are our only fans too. Let's yeah, exactly. I, whatever person got to do now, because like, <laughs> you got to think about in the hood, men, we had to sell dope most of the time or do something. And women was in the strip club. So I feel like the culture is getting better. At least they... You know, now you don't got to be in a strip club. You could be on the screen. <laughs> and one day it might end. Yeah, but yeah, I'm yeah. like, man, when somebody hustling, man, special colors nowadays, they ain't breaking the physical law of the world. You got to let that person ride because we just got money 100 years ago. No, you're right. You got to let us figure out. Mm -hmm. we, we know how to get, we don't figure out how to get money, but we ain't learn how to keep it yet. So mm -hmm. we got to, you got to let us, let, us, let people filter through they, whatever they do, man. If they ain't bothering you, dog, you can't be. You. I'd rather you do that than sell dope and yeah. rob. Yeah. Cause boy, they go to jail out like here. Uh people getting people getting touched, man, being a strip club, them girls, man, you know, so it's like, you gotta let people do their thing. And she charging to be on there. Uh, she charged me. I'm already on there. Oh, you're part of her friend. <laughs> <laughs> so let I'm, me ask you, what did you think when Facebook and Instagram went down? Man, be honest, I, I felt like a break because they went down on me a week before that. All the all the videos got disappeared. So that's what? when I panicked, like, oh Lord. Who got you? <laughs> I don't know what happened. It was something with Facebook. But when it went down, I didn't really notice because I was working, trying to, I was shooting other skits. I figured it'd be back up because, you know, you be on Facebook, stuff happens mm -hmm. sometimes with that thing. Mm -hmm. yeah. Like, it, it'll it drop the money. It'll go all the way down, the videos. You got to get on phone with Facebook. So I was like, hey, I'm, I feel like I've worked with Facebook them now. So I was like, it'll be back. It's mm -hmm. something going on. Mm -hmm. That's just part of the, um, that's just part of the movement with Facebook. Why you got condoms? Uh, nah, nah, man, these 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 uh Percocets. Percocets. <laughs> no, nah, man, it's gone, man. It's gone, Solomon. man. I, I use I use condom now. Okay. Yeah. Why they don't fuck with you the way they fuck with Nick Cannon? They always talk about, oh, if I see Nick Cannon, I'm gonna get pregnant. They should be doing the same thing to you. Y'all talking with me? Yes. Nah, man. I people... think Nick did a lot in a short period of time. Oh, that's why. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. People, people don't bother me because you kind of, you kind of, because like with me, <laughs> every, when people feel like you ain't going to respond or you don't care, people feel that vibe off of you. It's like with me and Jess, they went through that. They got off of me because they can tell I didn't care. Yeah, yeah, and I put yeah, up yeah. a video like, hey, man. Like, so I don't got that vibe. I, I don't even respond to comments. Man, I don't care for real. Like, I literally don't care. And, people, and most of your kids are grown. Like your youngest is how old? My uh, my children sixteen to three. Oh. Um, honest, honest three. Tony sixteen, and they all, man, them children, them children rock with each other, man. They close. It's like hell. If I didn't have them, I wouldn't know what to do. Cause I need some employees, you know. <laughs> <laughs> That's the hardest thing to do in business is find good employees. Oh man, so the EP out now? Yeah, the EP out, man. Drippers okay. ain't doing good too, man. Yep, hit hit like twenty one on the chart. Yeah, on the on the on the Apple charts. Yep, yeah. for sure. 
So, yeah, man. All right, well, well, let's push it up even higher. Yo, I appreciate up. y'all letting us come through for real, man. This is I a real love. blessing for y'all to let Drip come through. This is history to make it, man. Y'all let Drip come through and do his thing on the on legendary Breakfast, Breakfast Club, Club, man. <laughs> and I appreciate y'all, man, 100, for real. Nah, Country yeah. Wayne is Zaytoven, a.k.a. Drippin' Zay. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you for pulling up, brother. No problem. Appreciate, appreciate it, man. you, man. It's love. Breakfast Club. Gone.